Well, tonight, Ontario police are investigating a YouTube video posted online, which appears to involve a city councilman up for re-election. CBS 2's Crystal Cruz explains why some people believe it may be a case of dirty politics. Whatever's going on in this Ontario neighborhood, a car parked in the middle of the street, people huddled up against a fence, had someone concerned enough to pull out a camera and make a phone call. Well, we have two parents and a younger girl in front of our house, and they're, they're like, hitting her really hard. I don't know what's going on. I don't know. She looks maybe in her teens. The father is hitting her right now. Underneath the video posted on YouTube Tuesday is a caption that reads in part, did the police cover up Councilman Wapner's actions? Why did the mother not stop the child from being hit rather than screaming at the neighbor to get back in their house? Ontario City Councilman Alan Wapner, who retired from the Ontario Police Department in 98, says he's aware of the video but wouldn't comment further. Police sent us this statement. On October 8th, the City of Ontario received media inquiries regarding a YouTube video uploaded on October 7th. The video appears to depict a disturbance and is currently under review by the Ontario Police Department. Wapner's attorney says the video is more than a year old and might be dirty politics released by someone weeks ahead of the November election. In front of the home where the video may have been shot are Wapner's opponent's campaign signs. The homeowners declined to comment and so did their attorney. Opponent Ruben Valencia says he found out about the video on Tuesday and people have been asking him questions. They want to know if CPS was called. They wanted to know if... Uh, an actual police report was taken. Did you have anything to do with this video being posted onto YouTube? No, I did not. In Ontario, Crystal Cruz, CBS 2 News.